Welcome everyone to TacosTheGeeks.com. Justin here, back finally with more comic book reviews. And today we are going to be talking about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Naruto number one. And TMNT has just been doing a lot of crossovers. They have, I mean, just, just think about who they've crossed over with. I would say in this past decade, Batman, Power Rangers, recently He-Man, I believe G.I. Joe and Transformers as well, correct me if I'm wrong, but yeah, they have just been crossing over with everybody, and for the anime fans, this is something for you guys as well, so let's talk about it. Here is a brief synopsis of the book. The heroes in the half shell meet the hosts of the Nine Tail Fox in this crossover everyone will be talking about. When April O'Neil has a meeting with the leader of the Hidden Leaf Village, it garners the attention of Naruto, Sasuke, Sakura, and Kakashi. They aren't the only ones who are wondering what the two women were discussing, though. The Sinister Foot Clan has their own interest in April's visit, as they think she might hold valuable information on mutation research that was being conducted by Baxter Stockman. With April caught between the forces of the Hidden Leaf Village and the Foot Clan, it can't be long before the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles send up to send aid. And that is what we're going to be talking about today the first issue i really enjoyed it it's a simple premise here april is from the big apple village which they call it <laughs> she's from the big apple village and she is had she had a meeting with the hidden leaf village leader and now their mission is naruto sasuke kakashi and uh sakura their mission is now to get april back home unfortunately they are run in by the foot clan and let's just say the rest of the issue is nothing but action packed the foot clan decide to run and let's just say i won't spoil any more than that but we do get the interaction between of course the hidden leaf village and the teenage mutant ninja turtles and i will just this is not this is just a minor spoiler i'll just tell you the matches, the fights, who's fighting who. So you have Kakashi versus Splinter. You have Sasuke versus Leonardo. You have Sakura versus Raphael. And you have Tani and Mikey taking on Naruto. And if you are a fan of the manga, if you're fan, a fan of the anime, you're going to be really geeking out with some of the attacks. And it's very curious to see like how the turtles were able to hold up. Obviously... Certain attacks weren't used, but there is the clone attack that uh, Naruto used as well. And I thought it was really fun. It was a really, really fun issue. I like the art style of this. I like to see where this is going. The Turtles crossovers usually do a really good job. I really think they always nail it and knock it out of the park with this. But for this particular issue, uh, it's, it's just a really kind of an introduction. And it, in the ending makes me wonder how... Kakashi really is tied up in this because there's something that happens at the end where I was just going, hmm, did someone train or did they cross paths with a certain character? So I I, I really liked what they did with this. It's an action-packed adventure so far. Not too much in the plot or, or story driven. They did give you a little exposition on why April is there because what Baxter Stockman's trying to do is trying to obviously do another experiment in terms of mutation. And he's thinking about the Hidden Leaf Village. And there, there's little things in, in there that I won't get into because it'll be considered a spoiler. But overall, folks, I really love the art style. I thought the dialogue was true to at least the teen Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And I will say some of the manga, too. The dialogue was just really, really nailed the characters here. So... I'm going to give this a read it, folks. I really had fun with this. Definitely check this one out. This is Justin from MatakosTheGeeks.com. If you like what we do here, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Helps out the channel tremendously. And if you like what we do, hopefully we'll earn your subscription, my friends. And I'll catch you on the next one. If you read this crossover, what do you think about it? Come, comment below. Let me know. And what is your favorite team in TMNT crossover? I can't talk today for some reason. What is your favorite turtle crossover? Is it Batman? Is it Power Rangers? Is it, I believe they met G.I. Joe. Correct me if I'm wrong. Is it the new He-Man one? Comment below. Let me know. Turtles is always crossing over. Uh, who would you like to see them cross over with next? Since they're already now in the manga slash anime world. Later days, folks.